internet, it's Rabazoid. I just picked this motor shield up um, from Speed Studios at Radio Shack and I wanted to give it a little demo and see how it worked. Um, the unit's pretty cool. It houses a L298NH bridge um, and it could power either two standard um, motors, DC motors, or one um, stepper motor. I knew I had a couple extra stepper motors at my house, so I figured, hey, um, let's test it out and see how it works. Um, the cool thing about it is it actually has all these little, what they they call um, onboard Grove connectors, and each one has, I don't know if you can see it, a positive and negative, and either two analog or two digital um, pins. So it makes connecting other devices to this device and Arduino again um, pretty sweet and pretty easy. Um, so anyways, I got a standard um, sketch on there and it's just going to spin the wheel 100% one way and then spin it the other way after half a second pause. So the motor has 200 steps in it, um, but the actual gear requires I think 980 steps from this, from the motor to actually spin this gear entirely. It rattles a lot if there's no uh, pulley on it. It's pretty cool, you see it's got LED telling you when you're getting power and you're not. Overall, it works pretty good. Right now it's just being powered by the USB, but um, you can power it by, I believe, 6 to 15 volts. Yep, 6 to 15 volts. There's a built-in um, power regulator, so if you're powering it through that, you don't need to have the USB as long as this um, jumper is enabled. Um, and that's pretty much it. Set it. That's all it does.